You asked what I think about Kizomba. Well, you ask, you get. Hello, my beautiful subscribers. Rosa the Dancer is here, and today we're talking about Kizomba. I don't think I have ever made on this channel a video about Kizomba, but some of you have been talking about it and you've been asking me some questions. And one of the questions is basically whether I like it, what I think about it, and what do I think about the scene. So this video is going to be kind of like my first uh, little video where I express my opinion about Kizomba and what I think about the Kizomba scene. Now, before I start telling you all of my opinions, you need to know I am not a professional Kizomba dancer or teacher. I do Kizomba um, very well. <laughs> and I've been in many different places dancing Kizomba. I just don't do it for money okay because it's it's just not my speciality um but i have a lot of experience with kizomba in terms of dancing it and being around kizomba uh, people and kizomba teachers and in the congresses and all of the rest so i will tell you my humble opinion right now let me start by saying i love kizomba i love everything about it i love the music i love the dance and I love um, the, the whole vibe when you go to a congress. It's a completely different vibe than if you go to salsa or bachata. And I love it. I really do. Um, of course, in Kizomba, same as bachata, at this point, you have many different styles. Um, you have, of course, Kizomba, Kizomba. But then you have the urban kiss, which is a little bit more like robotic with some, some hip hop elements, some tango elements. Uh, music is completely different. You have Tarashinia, you have like hip rotations and stuff. And so there's many different, which we can explore some other time. That's not what the video is about. But uh, I love Kizomba. I think the music is great and the dance is so different and it reminds me a little bit of tango in some weird places, the hold and stuff. Um, so in general, as a dance and music is great. I have my own preferences in terms of kizomba, of course, as uh, in terms of music, um, I probably lean more towards the, the middle as I like to say. So I'm not so much necessarily into um, the authentic Kizomba music. I'm more into uh, music with a lot of bass and stuff. Um, but it's it's just, you know, it's just what I feel more. Um, but overall, Kizomba, great. All right, so now Kizomba scene as a whole, again, depends where you're gonna go is what you're gonna get so it doesn't mean that everywhere is the same and so happens i believe that if you go somewhere that has more traditional kizomba the scene is a little bit more seems to be respectful of each other and the space if you're gonna go to some places where it's kind of a bit of a mix of a situation I have experienced some places that are questionable and I have never experienced what I have experienced with Kizomba in Bachata or Salsa. Never. <laughs> I mean, with Kizomba, some places, don't take it as a norm, some places are just, wow. Um, inappropriate is not the word okay it's borderline something else okay i had many situations when i've been asked to dance by a guy and he's dancing with me and i feel like there's a third person between us if you get my drift it's it's if it would be one guy i would say you know there's gotta be one <laughs> but not one not two not three and not one place okay i 
I find it a struggle because it's hard to talk about it or why is that without, you know, going into some deep uh, cultural things or environmental things of women allowing it and they're there for that reason. Men think it's cool and they're there for that reason. That's why I say like it's not everywhere, but there are places like that. Zomba, you dance a little bit closer most of the time. So again, it's it's usually not in the, you know, the original kizomba, it's the authentic kizomba. It's usually when there's a mix of different styles when that happens. And it's 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 questionable. It's questionable. And that could be another subject that we can talk about. But I can see how some people are being turned off to dance kizomba. Uh, because it is it is really much like a lot of experiences questionable however keep in mind it's just a matter of if you discover that that's the place you leave and you never go back there but there's loads of places where it's absolutely beautiful wonderful respectful like any dance like you will be good dance tango you dance tango very close as well you know chest to chest contact and nothing nothing inappropriate whatsoever so it's knowing the dance being in the right place being taught by the right teachers it, it can be the most beautiful experience and nobody should not dance kizomba i go out and i dance kizomba i love it it's just you know i through time found out where i belong and where not <laughs> you know what i mean but yes i i have experienced some some things and 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 it does make me wonder like how is this happening and final thing that I want to mention here for this video is that in congresses, uh, Kizomba room, like if in Congress, if you have like a full Congress SBK, so you have salsa, bachata and Kizomba, Kizomba room is, is usually so fascinating uh, because it always the last one to close. Maybe because it, the dance is a bit slower and it's less energy than salsa or bachata, we tend to go crazy and Kizomba is a bit more relaxed. Um, maybe that's where they can last longer. They also start later. <laughs> so they usually don't start 9 p.m. You know, they're going to start 12, 1, whatever. But also, like, you have this different vibe towards the end of the night. The music kind of slows down, and you're just there with your with your partner kind of gliding through the floor. And I, I, I think it's awesome because, you know, when you dance all night, and you like with salsa bachata for me and then you go to the kizomba room i love it because it's kind of like you're still dancing but you're cooling down and then afterwards you can go home you know or you can go to your uh hotel room and sleep and you you know you, you got your vibe down from like ah to ta -ta 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 -ta. i i like it and it's fascinating for me to watch because a lot of people just almost barely moving but it's 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 kind of cool and experience it as well so i i enjoyed that aspect as well in the congress when they have a kizomba room i always escape and i go there and i have my little dances especially towards the end of the night i love it so guys that's my opinion about kizomba it's a short little video but if you want more and so that i will go in depth a little bit more about the things that i have mentioned leave a comment and i'll make sure to do more videos for kizomba i also can happily bring some of my kizomba friends that are teachers so that you will get a little bit more of a uh, broader perspective about kizomba and not just my opinion but actually somebody who knows more about kizomba scene uh, from a professional side and we can do those videos too but leave a comment for me to know if there's enough people asking for it you shall receive and now subscribe if you haven't and i'm gonna leave you with more videos about dancing keep exploring and i will see you soon Bye.